You might not realize it, but you've never seen a bin lorry like this before. The 26-tonne electric converted Dennis is soon to be collecting rubbish around the city of Sheffield. It's described as eco-friendly, not least because it's powered by energy created by burning household waste. We really use our waste as a resource and really putting it back into the vehicle means that actually for Sheffield we're really on the forefront of actually turning the whole waste industry into a circular economy, using the waste we're producing in the city to be used by the vehicles in the city. Sheffield's Energy Recovery Centre burns 235,000 tonnes of waste to generate low carbon electricity. Some of that is now being used to charge the batteries on the new style bin lorry, previously a diesel and transformed by a local firm. We've stripped out the engine, the gearbox, the radiator, the exhaust system, all the things that make noise, get hot, wear out, are dirty. Um, they've all gone out of the vehicle. And when you take those things out of the vehicle, the rest of the vehicle is actually good for another seven years. So it makes good economic sense to actually recondition that chassis, paint it, recondition the cab, and then fit a zero emission drivetrain back into it and give it a new lease of life for another seven years. This vehicle really is quite a beast. It's fantastic. With the size of those batteries, that will keep it powered up for quite a few hours. But what I want to know is, what's it like out on the road? What's it like to drive? Knock, knock. Hey, up, Ian. Now then, Paul, what are you up to? Waiting for you to go for a test drive. Oh, I can have a ride, can I? Yeah, you can. What's it like to drive? Smooth, powerful and quiet. And not too smelly? Not smelly, not yet. <laughs> right, well, let's give it a try. In the bag. Look at that. So this is the moment of truth, Paul. You'd better get it started up then. It's already started. But I can't hear it. Uh, so quiet, isn't it? Quieter than a diesel. That is amazing, that actually. But that makes roll. a difference, doesn't it? Yeah, go on, take us away then. Let's go for a spin. You could hear a pin drop inside the cabin, <laughs> and the vehicle's locally built technology is constantly working to keep the power on. And now when you're going down a hill, it um, actually recharges the battery up. Converting one bin lorry to electricity is like taking 30 diesel cars off the roads. So if the trial is successful, it'll soon be out with the old and in with the new. Ian White, BBC Look North, Sheffield. You could say that was a rubbish report from you, <laughs> <didn't> you? <laughs> How dare you? <laughs>